Hello, I am Ronan Chris Murphy from Recording Bootcamp. When we were working on this drum recording bootcamp course that we just launched, we had an idea for an experiment. And the experiment was, you know, if we applied the principles that I talk about in the course, in terms of understanding phase and mic placement and, uh, you know, prepping the drums, all of that, could we actually get a pretty darn good drum sound using just four Shure SM57s? We did the experiment and I'm actually pretty stoked with it. So here, check this out. This is just uh, four Shure SM57s with no processing at all, except there is a little bit of limiting on the audio of this video. So check this out. So I was really happy to see that this actually pans out. So those four SM57s recording in this space that is just a converted living room, no big fancy high-end studio. Then I wanted to take things one step further because half the course is about tracking drums and the other half is about mixing drums. And could I take this pretty solid drum sound and really step it up to another level just using stock EQs and compressors and reverbs, etc., that came with the DAW. So I did a little bit of tweaking and this is what we ended up with. So the whole point of this, and really the whole point of drum recording bootcamp is, if you apply kind of smart techniques in terms of how you approach recording the drums, and use smart techniques about mixing the drums to make the most of the tools you've got, you can end up with really, really killer drum sounds uh, just in your living room and stock EQs and compressors and reverbs, etc., that just came with your DAW. So if you're interested, you can go to the link below and download the four raw tracks of the four Shure SM57s on this drum set. And uh, if you're watching this in a way where you do not have a link right below, just head on over to drumrecordingbootcamp.com and I'll make sure that there's a link there that you can get and download the audio samples. And if by any chance you think that we've made this up, you could actually just take those raw samples and sync, sync them up with this video you just watched. Because there's a lot more mics you see in the images of the drums, but we only use those four in the mix that we presented to you. All right, that's it. And never let your situation or your gear get in the way of you making awesome records.